Olympics are American rivals. And here the are the two-time American silver medalists, Madison Chalk and Evan Bates, both uh, from Michigan and both former world junior champions, but with other partners. And this is their fourth season together. They were eighth at the Olympics in Sochi, fifth at the World Championships in the spring, and are widely seen as the heir apparent to the U.S. ice dance throne. Now that Davis and White are in hiatus. I saw a huge step up in Madison's, not necessarily her skating skills, but her presentation of herself on the ice. And a lot of that seems to be about off-ice dance training. change of position live there again musically appropriate goes with the theme I'm doing a Spanish waltz nice save there from Madison in the twizzle doesn't take much to catch your edge and all of a sudden you're having a very close conversation with the ice After watching many Paso Dobles in a row, this musical choice and feeling comes right out of the sky. This is a Completely almost different, a happy, isn't it? Yes, it's a jolly, jolly almost a jolly little number. a certain thing while watching all the other teams. Exactly. And, and now you just can't compartmentalize them into the same place. Not at all. As far as the hometown crowd goes from the U.S., I think it's, and they're skating last. It's hit the spot, hasn't Yeah, it's it? yes. right on. <laughs> Jogging Bates has certainly seen as the top ice dance team right now in the U.S. and they want to keep it that way and certainly being first after the short would help, wouldn't it? Certainly would. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Madison Chuck. It was a very good skate. I mean, just because United something States. doesn't appeal to you style-wise doesn't mean it's not a good program. You know, not, you're not going to like everything, are you? And like the sit-spin twizzles, if it appeals to you style-wise, you, style you might not get any points. <laughs> exactly. I, I guess I felt it, it was it was like I was watching an exhibition skate, yes. not a competitive skate. Uh, I'm not even sure if that's a complaint, but it felt a little watered down compared to the other ones. And yet, it was very pleasing. So was, I, yes. I'm saying absolutely nothing, I guess. I'm, I'm, <laughs> Which is sometimes best where I start seeing I'm walking right <laughs> along that line of going nowhere. Yeah. Did you enjoy it? 
don't know. There you are. So I we're still know. in the same place. Yes. I don't know. I did. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed their skating. I thought they did some really nice things in the program. I'm just not sure if that particular interpretation appeals to me. That's uh, okay. I'm going to finally leave the line and go out on the limb and say that I actually enjoyed the Shibitani skate and program better, or at least the program. I and would agree style, with you. That style uh, appealed to me more. We should write that down, Kurt. We okay. agreed on something. <laughs> <laughs> Extension all the way in slow-mo. If you are extending your leg all the way and if you're hitting those edges now perfectly scores, through the slow-mo, that's a test. I think they were doing the United that. States. Well, the Shibitanis with the lead. Dance. The score is 64. 0.14 points point and six. four points that higher there for Madison Chalk and Evan Madison. Bates. So after and the short them, dance, they place. have the lead here at Skate America. This concludes the short dance competition.